everyone, my name is Stephanie Brower, and once again, I am here to share one practical reading tip you can do in your home to create a love of reading. Today's reading tip is all about the library bag. I believe that if you gift each of your children with their own personal library bag, they're going to be more excited about going to the library, filling up their bag with books, and going home and reading those books. Now, you know your child best, so I'm not gonna tell you what specific library bag to purchase. However, I do have three tips when it comes to shopping for that perfect library bag. Number one, look for a bag that isn't gonna tear easily. A cute bag doesn't necessarily mean practical when it comes to hauling around heavy books. So I recommend a canvas bag. They're thick, they're sturdy, and they're made to outlast countless trips to the library. The second thing I make sure I look for is that my bag has a pocket in it with a zipper. Here's why. It's really convenient to keep your library card inside your library bag. And if it has a zipper on it, your child will hopefully not lose that precious library card. Finally, look for a bag that fits your child's personality. A cheap and fun idea is to buy just a plain bag and have your son or daughter decorate it with some fabric markers or fabric paint. That's what I did with my two-year-old. As you can see, I helped her with the front, but then I let her just do whatever she wanted with the back. And she had a great time doing this. However, I am not saying that you have to do this. If this doesn't interest you, by all means, do not do it. Instead, think about what your child is interested in. If they're into hunting, maybe find a camouflage bag. If they're into horses, you could find a Western style bag. You could even go online and get a bag that has your child's name on it. The options are endless. No, I am not telling you to go spend hundreds of dollars on a library bag. What I am saying is that I think you'll be surprised how a library bag can make a difference in getting your kids excited about going to the library and reading some books. Thanks for watching today's reading tip. And remember, when books are read, hearts are fed. See you next time.